Breaking news overnight, the search is on for the driver that slammed into a home causing serious damage. Anaritis Rodriguez is live in Everett this morning with the very latest from the scene. Anaritis? Good morning, Chris and Kay. Good morning to you at home. You can notice behind me that the section of the home has been boarded up since debris has been swept up. The good news in all of this is that nobody was injured, but police say that they're still looking for the driver. We spoke to someone who works nearby just a short time ago, and I just want to give you a lay of the land here in Everett. This is a main street. This is Ferry Street. The person who works nearby tells us that just after midnight, they noticed a van driving south on Ferry past the 7-Eleven, and they noticed that the driver lost control around uh, that corner up a block away. And the driver didn't stop. That van didn't stop until it slammed into this home on the corner of Ferry and Ashton Street. You can notice from uh, the video from our cameras that our crew gathered overnight that police were here. The building inspector was here. They responded to the incident shortly after. And you can see just the damage left behind from the impact of this crash. It caused part of the section of the frame to cave in and buckle, and even a slab of concrete crumbled. We know that one car had to be towed from the scene. We don't know if it was the van involved. We can notice here back live on Ferry Street that there is some damage to the front end of this silver Toyota. Uh, but police say they're still looking for the driver. We're going to continue to follow the latest information and bring you information not only on CBSBoston.com, but throughout the day here on WBZ. For now, we're live in Everett. I'm Anaritis Rodriguez, WBZ This Morning.